Now I want to talk about the immune system. Uh, Dr. Masihi used to teach for immunology. We both had years of microbiology, biochemistry, and virology studies. We've made it our life's work to understand this stuff. And here, I'd like to go over some basic things about how the immune system functions so people have a good un understanding. The immune system is built by exposure to antigens, viruses, bacteria. When you're a little child crawling on the ground, putting stuff in your mouth, viruses and bacteria come in, you form an antigen antibody complex, you form IgG, IgM, this is how your immune system is built. You don't take a small child, put them in bubble wrap in a room and say, go have a healthy immune system. This is immunology, microbiology 101. This is not something, this is the basis of what we've known for years. Um, so what I'm seeing is when you take human beings and you say, go into your house, clean all your counters, Lysol them down, you're going to kill 99% of viruses and bacteria, wear a mask, don't go outside. What does it do to our immune system? Our immune system is used to touching. We share bacteria, staphylococcal, streptococcal bacteria, viruses. We develop an immune response daily to this stuff. When you take that away from me, my immune system drops. As I shelter in place, my immune system drops. You keep me there for months, it drops more. And now I'm at home hand washing vigorously, washing the counters, worried about things that are indeed what I need to survive. Let's follow the science. This is immunology, folks. This is microbiology. This is what we've combined together. We have 40 years of experience in this. This is common sense immunology. So quarantining and social distancing is worse for us, you're saying? It decreases your immune system. You, you can't build an immune system by, if, if someone has a, a reduced immune system, you, you hide them away because they can't build an immune system. If you have a normal functioning immune system, you need interaction. The, the, when a child's in a womb, you're in this protected environment. When you come out, you have almost no immune system. You develop that through touching your mouth, touching your eyes, virus, bacteria, virus, bacteria, immune response, IgG, IgM. This is how you build a strong immune system. Do you think people are worrying too much? Of course they are, but that's, that's from media telling them to. I am telling them sheltering in place decreases your immune system. And then as we all come out of shelter in place with a lower immune system and start trading viruses and bacteria, what do you think is going to happen? Disease is going to spike. And then you've got disease spike amongst a hospital system with furloughed doctors and nurses. This is not the combination we want to set up for a healthy society. It doesn't make any sense.